Today I am going to make myself a little journal uh, that I've been wanting to do for several years. This is a Pinterest inspired um, journal that I saw, I don't know, at least four years ago and um, I've never had the time to do it but now I do and this little box was just um, something I was kind of hanging on to because I thought, oh how cute would that be? to do a, um, to make as a tiny journal, and then, you know, I was going through Pinterest the other night, and I happened to spot, um, the journal that I'd seen years ago, so, um, yeah, I just thought, okay, I'm just going to do this, um, unfortunately, this one's going to have to be two music, it's just going to be a process journal, and I'm not going to be doing a lot of, um, embellishing on this guys. All I'm going to do is just add some coffee dyed papers um, to the, you know, as the signatures and then just maybe to a pocket on the inside and back cover if I even do that. I don't know. But let's just um, get started and I will put some, uh, I will speed this up because I think this is going to be, could probably take me quite a while to do. Um, so I'll speed this up and put it to music and I hope you'll enjoy it. Um, I'll see you guys back here at the end and we'll do a little flip through.
Okay guys, that is the finished little journal. This is two and three quarters by four inches finished. Um, I just added one of the little Tim Holtz tokens with a bulb pin and you saw me stitch on some things. Um, this is a stamped image of course and then some sorry silk. And uh, I had debated whether I was going to just leave this a neutral, but I think the green, particularly since I ended up going with this um, on the front, I, th I really think that it needed that, just that little bit of color there. But I love it. <laughs> I'm so excited. Now I want my crafting space so I can get this put up. I haven't done anything inside. Again, this is just something that when I want to I can pull it down and just you know add little things inside but it will very much be within the greens purples and just neutrals I'm just thinking maybe do some stamping um, some little flips I'm not gonna get crazy with this one because um, that's not the look I want I want this to be a really rustic project but that just goes to show you guys what you can do with leftover packaging so uh, I have got a couple of other little projects in store to upcycle these types of things so I hope that you will stay tuned if you haven't subscribed I hope you'll consider doing so and uh, I will be back soon guys take care and stay safe bye bye mm -hmm.